another fish out video. I thought I'd do a quick one on pond heating. Uh, this is the, my new heat source pump. I've uh, been installing over the last three days. <sighs> to say I'm impressed is an understatement. So, there's the outlet and inlet. Pipes going in. There's the current temperature. It's set at 25. It's currently at 24. Um, what I've actually done with this pipe, I've, I had loads of loft insulation left. So I've wrapped that round and then put this uh, waterproof, like it's like a tin, it's like a foil um, over. And this is all going to get boxed in. I ain't finished yet. This is where I've got so far. Um, comes in the wall there, comes across. The flexi pipes go in. I ran out of um, hard pipes, so I need to get some more of that. But for the time being, it's it's in. Goes there, up to the easy pod. It comes out this bottom drain, the bottom drain under there, comes along there, through to that that uh, hose lock BioForce revolution, and then from there to the pump, and then back from that heat pump to the easy pod, which is completely covered i'll just take you around the front so you can see the pond so then excuse the mess like i say we're still working in here but the pond's back up and running so if i sit down here there's pond up and running again took two days to get 4000 liters to 25 degrees we've had below freezing at night so i'm pretty impressed with that main thing is everyone's back in back in the pond all the gar are back in and there's bottom drain that's a bysh's tail uh there and then if you look over here at the glare and yeah it's looking it's looking spot on. So the room, with the pond being heated, the room's at 14.1. The pond's currently sat at 23.8. When it drops to 23, the pump will kick back in, heat it back to 25. It currently, um, it came on once in the middle of the night last night. And it's come on once this morning um, for what, 20 minutes? And then it heat, it's back up to 20, 24 degrees, 25 degrees. Cost me uh, 15p when it's running. So yeah, long term, we'll see what that's like. But at the minute, I'm happy compared to what I was before with the inline heaters, which is costing me an absolute fortune. Gar happy, I'm happy. Really impressed with that pump to be honest. Should have done it a long time ago. So yeah, just need to tidy up now, clean up. It's been a long process. I think I've got about another week's worth of work cleaning up, insulating the the actual room. Finish the roofing, the ceiling. And I've got to get some more tanks in. But yeah. Happy days. So I just thought I'd share that with you. e source pumps, I think, are the way to go, especially with the Ryzen Electric. Very impressed. Cool. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.